Hello Fluffies! Do, yes, we do hear it. How are you guys? I know this is not a regular time for me to stream, but apparently this is what we are doing today because I'm leaving in two days for Japan. So I wanted to do another live stream before uh, also do this event in a live stream because I was only able to do it. I recorded my screen on Monday on the... I was uh, in London. I know I'm traveling again a lot, like uh, last fall, I guess. And I will stay for three and a half, four weeks almost in Japan. So definitely there will be another event, uh, another update at that point. So I will have to do it from Japan. Hi, welcome back. I did not play at all today. Yay. I heard your phones may be coming soon. Coco. Pom Pom Porin's Mama. Pom Pom Porin's Papa. And I have everybody, so I'm good. Okay, ingots. Good. Okay, and today we get dye. So I'm wearing the dress that the skirt that we got yesterday. Let's see. So Nothing really special today, but I have, oh, oh yes, a Rocky edition, perfect. So I want to do the daily quests with you guys and also the event. And also I'll take a couple hours to do the flowers, I guess. Uh, I saw that somebody found it very interesting to see my flower setup, so this is interesting. I'm not sure if it change it a lot or not. Um, we'll see. So let's first collect all the petals. So this was three. We'll see about the flowers later. That's four. And five. There's not one here, so six could be here. Let's see. No, okay. So two more. Could be one here, six and seven should be here. Okay, good, seven. Good, good, good. Let's go see my melody and what she has for sale today. Oh, we even have. Samara, hello. Maybe he can collect something for me. Let's see. Yes. What do I want him to collect? Maybe spinips. What about you, my melody? What do you want to collect today? You said something about my problems. No, I have too many. Um. I actually managed to fall under 999. Yes. Okay, what are you selling, my melody? Oh no. I'm doing the wrong thing. Hi, Helen! Do you think they will fix the issue with saying character is visiting if they live on the island? So this is not an issue. Uh, actually, they said that if you want to move your character around, this is useful to know who is coming back. So they say it's not a bug, it's on purpose. And if it's annoying, maybe just click, click, click super fast. But apparently it is not a bug according to the devs. Okay, I don't know why I'm 
gifting my melody with um i just wanted to check what she has for sale oh the curry sofa i never have enough curry sofa and also coastal plant those are cute what else the rest is fine oh that i could maybe change it later uh customize it so uh, let's see what day requests do we have oh also oh kiki we need to <gasps> see i have zero other quests in those this is crazy uh so creature in rainbow wave interesting change the outfit seaside resort and okay well gift kiki we'll catch oh you know what we'll catch one here with the bubble wants to this is fun uh, come on oh yeah no there's maybe not that many at night normally there's still some oh yes So while I'm here, you guys could also collect something for me. What am I looking for? You know what? Cena bloom and apples. I don't have that many apples and now you cannot even get 30 more apples when doing the game. Bugging for apples, now it's ghost apples. Okay, so rainbow reef. So I guess if we just go to the comedy club, there should always be, yes, Chrissy Pony here. Hello, okay and then kiki and then what was the last one don't remember am i enjoying the color blaze challenge yes but i think it's sad that it's so short um i wish we had more to do or we had to collaborate with other people not necessarily um multiplayer but maybe we should maybe if they were difficult enough we'll have to use some characters and try try several times to reach it or something maybe it will keep getting harder but for now they're so so easy oh and today we should maybe be able to see the first marigold blue that should be exciting Okay, what was the last one? Oh, change in the mirror. Okay. And then here we are all good. And here also. I have every one. And so today, those are the two complete. Yeah, we are still missing one more. There's still two weeks and three days. Maybe it's the last week or something. Maybe when there's 10 days. No. Yeah, maybe tomorrow we'll see the introduction of the new one. We'll see. And so collections. Let's see. Yeah, because we're missing, everybody's missing one here. So that will be in the finale. And that, we might get another one today, another furniture. And this, I guess it's for later in 1.6 and then i'm still missing one comic book let's go get the comic book now uh, i mean let's go look for the comic book i've been actively looking for the comic book since november or something like that every single day and this is crazy Okay, I'm just getting ready for planting later. So, what if? 
finally I get this last comic book before going to Japan there would be one less thing to do during my holiday because I have so the first week I need to work at my pop-up store from 11 to 8 p.m. every day for seven days in a row and then I need to film content if new things come up and also I need to do a lot of exercise for my shoulder the physical therapist gave me exercises to do hi Rukiv oh you're new here you've been playing this almost a month good welcome I think you've been I don't know if it's in my discord or the official discord but I've seen I've seen your name somewhere how are you it's nice to see you so yeah I'm hoping that I won't have too much to do in the game but if no I mean I'm pretty sure there will be new updates because I'm there for four weeks and they said there will be updates every six to eight weeks and we've been having 1.5 for more than a month now so yeah I'm pretty sure it will come in the next two weeks So that will be complicated for me to make keep making content, but don't worry, I won't I won't forget you guys while I'm in Japan. Also the reset will be at 4 pm and not at 8 a.m. like it is usually for me. So like I said I won't be able to stream anyways, so but also I will not be able to play at reset because 4 p.m. usually I will be either working or or doing some visit or something like that so I'll play at night or super early in the morning we'll see okay so I've looked at all the um, comic books and they're not here so let's see let I'm wondering if we see the challenge okay so i think we should still talk to pochako first but then we see that it's next to tam and tam today and apparently if you miss a day you can still do them all together later let's see hi bx Ray, how are you uh you did not join my discord but you do know cool thank you you said you want get to go to the Hello Kitty pop-up in London okay so I've been this weekend and honestly the expo itself was meh but the pop-up was so 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 amazing honestly if you can't go I'm really sad for you because this is really something amazing oh I can ask him can you find something for me oh yes what have I got and then the color blaze challenge tap on your map basically it still tells me to go talk to him because he has a exclamation point but also he won't he he only tells me to just go check it myself So it is here. Okay, are we ready? I hope that they get more and more difficult because other than that it's a little bit sad because it's just two seconds and that's it. And we got a chair. Okay, so that's it. 
for this event. <laughs> but we got one more thing from the collection. And hopefully more event flowers. Okay. Tomorrow we get a t-shirt, something like that. Oh, what was the last one? Oh, yes. A change in it. Mirror. Uh, yeah, this one is even more colorful. Yay! Okay. So I've seen people saying that this color blaze carnival is inspired by the Indian holiday Holi. And yesterday we were at, no, on Monday, was it? Yeah, on Monday, we were eating at an Indian restaurant in, um, in London. And they were all, the servers were all wearing t-shirts from Holly with many colors and also like colors on their face and everything. That was really fun. Okay, so quest we have on the adventure to get there that we, aha, uh, actually I have not set up to play with Mitzo at some point. I'll see later if she is available. We need to progress. Did we do, no, I don't think we said anything about that. Okay, so I'm all good with this. So honestly, apart from doing the flowers now, there's not that much to do. But the flowers usually take me a couple hours, if not more. The reset is at 2 p.m. for you. Where do you live? Okay, so flowers. Let me show you my, uh, I don't know, routine, flower routine. So there are, let's see, one, two, three, four. Okay, there's 16 spots in total for flowers. And I usually keep the most interesting for last. And so I always start by being sure it's daytime because then you see the flowers colors, the flower colors better. So I usually try to get first all the blooms. No, first I look if I have how much fertilizer do I already have to work with. I have zero. Okay, so to make fertilizer, I pick already all the blooms that I have because I don't need to. Now, if I want to water this one, it will bloom, but I could have fertilized it be before. So I don't want to lose the opportunity of fertilizing. <clears throat> Sorry. So I will only pick up the ones that are already bloomed and water. So then there's not a missed opportunity of fertilizing. Then it depends. Usually I go to the easy small ones that have, oh, in the Philippines, nice. So this one is an experiment for the bug that we are encountering. And I will be fixing 1.6. Nothing is bloomed here. And we have only one bloomed here. Was this this one? I think this one was ombre, right? It was ombre. So this is, I'm not used to the color on my screen. Okay, so this is pistachio and this is lime. So I think this is a lime, okay. Okay, so now the gate. Okay, 
we drop a couple here. And apparently I picked up a lot yesterday without turning them uh, into fertilizer at night. So I still have some that I work with. But the more you do right away, uh, the more you can work with without having to go back and forth 10 times to pick up some flowers, turn them into fertilizer, and then use it, and then you need fertilizer again. So you need to pick up more flowers. So this is a bit annoying. So I actually do... This is new that I'm going everywhere to see all the bloom ones. But it just saves me time. So the big field is what I'm leaving for last. Oh, look at that. We have uh, a yellow penstem on tomorrow. Oh, no, today. Maybe today, actually. Okay, all my things here are all for experiments and it's bugged at the moment, but I don't want to change that. No, I'm too lazy to replant and do something. So in, in the meantime, it's just something that I can use like that. Oh, look at this. This is a hot pink. Uh, oh, I did not get anyone to pick up the one tail. This is a hot pink ombre. This is so beautiful. I'll be sure not to put it in the poster yes oh my god it's so pretty and this one I don't know if you can see it yeah this one is a regular hot pink so pretty okay I'm also picking up all the seeds because that will be more fertilizer okay So at first I'm trying to see to keep only one of each seed, each color. So if I have multiple of the same color, I can make fertilizer with that. That's easy because I don't have that many. That's the oops, the way easy part. But now we have so many of all these that it's impossible to keep track. I keep wanting to put them, maybe if we have time today, to take them all and put them in the display thing to actually order them like I will pick them to put them in the order that I want ah but okay I think that was my idea but then it does not really work because the sprouts still will be will not be able to put in the display and then it, it won't be together that would be fun if I had the sprout and this oh maybe actually with the fertilizer I can do that, but this is a bit dangerous. Like, you know, I can pick this one and this one and this one. And now if I cancel, then let's see if if I cancel, does it go back? Oh yeah, no, it actually won't 
uh, move them, so that's okay. So, yeah. I just need to remember, okay, here I have all the pistachio ones, all the white ones, and things like that. Okay, two of this one. Oh, actually, no. So this is so so hard to do <laughs> to remember which one we've already seen or not. What do you guys think about flowers? Do you like flowers? Do you hate flowers? Is it overwhelming? Are you excited to get new things? I want to get everybody's feeling about that. I'm curious. Still working on Red School, even though I don't have to start crafting plane. I think this take me a week without crafting pen. Oh, maybe you actually commented on my videos. That was where I saw your thing. And so you... The, the two-star crafting plan is in a chest. Uh, and you can get it. And then you have... Uh, it's a lot easier. Did I? Was it you that I commented that? So if you find this chest, you will be able to gift higher things. Also, if you... Look at the, not necessarily, if you have one star, uh, one, one hurt things, you can actually look at the ones that are purple or that have four, um, four tags that will give more um, friendship than the ones that, that are, I don't know. Less. I don't know how to explain that. You like the flower, but it seems a bit overwhelming. I find the flower and animal crossing easier. Yes, I, I, I cannot imagine that I was overwhelmed in animal crossing. And then seeing here, there are literally thousands of flowers. It really makes me wonder why did they want to do this? Why did it decided to go with something that crazy? This is so crazy. I don't understand why they decided to do this. They could do something chill for honestly for a uh, cozy game. This this does not feel cozy because they know that so many people want to get everything and get overwhelmed, so I feel this is weird to have chosen chosen to do this. Why so many flowers? Honestly. But what I like is that we as a community get to figure out how things work and that is a fun aspect. That we all work together towards finding out the things. That is really fun. Did I see yellow somewhere? Okay, so. So I have the ombre and the sprout and the flower, then everything else can go. And I know that Chelsea this last week was doing a talk at uh, the game developer conference with another uh, game designer and she is from, I, I don't remember her what her title was. But she was working on the game that was called Wild Flowers. And I was wondering if anyone had played this game and know if it's... If the flowers is in the name of the game, 
Is it as overwhelming as this one is? Ah, uh, let me see. Do I have this one? Huh, this one I didn't have yet. But get this one. Especially when I eventually can get to plant anywhere, I'm looking forward to see when they expand the meadow. Maybe they might make it easier. Definitely there will be more plots there, I'm sure. Your red score is at least at level 9. So it's a struggle to get to level 11. Yeah, but uh, like I said, try to look if you can give her different gifts rather than the obvious ones. Then maybe that will help you grow faster. So here I have the dark, so the warm pink, and this is blush. So this is warm pink, and this is blush, maybe. Uh, and the green, I have both green here. Here, another like that. Okay, I'll probably get more of everything anyways later. But I think Red Skull was one of the last ones uh, I had to level up and it's very annoying. She is very long to level up, I agree. <gasps> I had a plant that I did not plant. Mm. A marigold plant that I did not plant. Okay, anyways. So, okay, um, sky and cloud is okay, and white and teal. So, sky and white and teal, and also. And that is Sifu. Takes ages, but it's worth it for the storyline. Yes, definitely. Green, so this is um, teal. So do I have the greens already? Yes, I have this one. So this one and this one can go. It takes ages to pick up everything, but people are looking forward to stacking. Honestly, I'm not sure when they will stack, if it will be easy to know which one we picked up last. I'm a bit afraid of this. Oh, wait. I actually went a little bit overboard. Okay, so then white and white ombre. So these. Okay, then green. Do I have another green? Okay. Then mint and seafoam. Okay. Then. Already too many. Okay, so the plants here, the green plants. Okay, so for green, I have it over there. And the flower for this one, yes. Purple. No, this is violet, sorry. Violet. Okay, then the red ombre flower. Okay, yellow ombre flower. I think this violet, I already had it, right? 
Okay, for now I keep my hot pinks. So yellow, do I have another yellow? Okay, so I have yellow, yellow ombre, the plant. So these two can go. Then this one, okay, the red, red, okay, so this can go. And violet, we have just this one. Okay. Oh, and this here. And also this one here. Okay, that should be it for now. Well. Everything that I was able to take and everything that I picked up yesterday. No, sorry. Mm. So, I should have close to 100 fertilizer, but that won't last that much. Let's see. Oh, 100. Okay, we can start with these now. So, these ones I will not fertilize because I already have it multiple of each. So I'm not fertilizing. I mean, multiple of the ombre flower. Yeah. So I'm just picking up the flower and this one. I cannot fertilize. I think this is, I don't remember, some kind of an ombre. This I'm definitely fertilizing because this is a marigold. This is my first marigold. Excited. Okay. So I'm thinking now and refertilizing and rewatering. Okay. So I think this is a new one. So I'm fertilizing, watering, and traveling to check it's either a red or a um sorry, it's a red or a coral. It's a red. No, wait, wait. It was not the sprout. It was not the sprout. It was this? Oh, so it is a hot pink. It is a hot pink. Amazing. So we'll keep this one. And so this one is a purple. I'm not watering it, um, fertilizing it. But this one that you cannot really see because of this branch, come on, is the hot pink. So I am fertilizing it. This one, I think it's a green. Green, I think I also have it. Maybe not into two. Uh, to what? To instances, I wanted to say. Okay, I did fertilize it, but that was a mistake. Technically, I should not fertilize the blue ones. Okay. I mean, sky. This is sky. Hey! Okay, so this one is a marigold that just spawned. It just came, so if I want to travel it today, it will disappear. So we'll not do that. No, cancel. Hey, come on. Okay, this one I can. And it's fine because it's actually both of them are next to this. I think it was this hot pink, right? So, in my transfer, I might make a, I might make an orange Tulia, which I don't care about, but I might make a hot pink, um, a hot pink marigold. So I would like that. So the marigold they just spawn randomly on your island. If you look at this, 
Maybe I'll zoom a little bit. If you're... Come on. E? See, the, the sprout is a little bit different. Sorry about the froggy here. The sprout is a little bit different than the other ones. So they just spawn on your island. Be sure to have some empty spots and they will just spawn. And you cannot do anything with it. You just have to... You cannot make um, seeds from them. So you can just hope that they will come. Julia, which one is it? Okay, a blue or a sky, I don't really care. And this one should be a green, I think. Yes. Okay. Yes, and here, what do I have? Is this a blue? Okay, one is a green and one is a blue. There's two greens. I think there's two greens, and I think this one is not necessary. I think it just spawned. Yes, so here I can make a teal, here I can make a green. No. Here, it's not really interesting, yeah, but here I can, I don't know, yeah, maybe just for this. Okay, so I'm done with the Tulias. Now, let's go to, come on, oh no, please don't do this. It's annoying when it's stuck. So, let's meet my first... Yellow pentamon! Oh no, it's tomorrow! Oh, I'm so sad, it's tomorrow. But look here, there is a baby. The baby is either yellow or green. Let's hope it's a yellow. It's a green. That's fine. Okay. So now here. I'm just here, I'm just watering. No fertilizing here because I already have all these flowers in the ombre version. And we know that there's a bug and you will, what I'm trying to do here will not work. So I'm not in a hurry to have them do other spots. See like this one here is a new marigold that just appeared. But okay, so here I have Maybe I should put um, one of the marigolds here. No, they don't do seeds. Because I have this, what is it? Is it the pink one? The yellow one? I don't know. Maybe it's the pink, um, hot pink? Um, hibiscus and I put it here so maybe I get the chances of getting a hot pink uh, velvet in somehow but also if I put the marigold next to it I get a chance for, for a marigold hot pink so apparently here I saw before yeah it's I hope they change the camera angles with 1.6, honestly, because this is so annoying. Okay, no, I cannot, because it's too early. And this one is just a white velvet in, that I should not have um, um, fertilized, but that's fine. Okay. So this is just to save on fertilizer. I'm not saying that you should never 
fertilizer in this case, but in my case, I don't have that much fertilizer, so this is what I'm doing. So let's go to the cozy islands. Here I have experiments to get new colors potentially and i have maybe nothing maybe this one can do something interesting and it did not this one did not do anything interesting so this is interesting because uh i've been having these here for a while and technically if I'm not mistaken there's a lot of potential for doing good and it does nothing I don't think I ever had something new spawn here How long do you does it take for you guys to tend to your flowers? Is it just me that I'm going a little bit overboard? Or, yeah, I don't know. Then I also spend a lot of time um, keeping track of which flower do I have, putting them in a spreadsheet, and then looking at what other people have, and what is the latest research on flowers. And when it's two days that I did not read the Discord, then it's, it's a mess. It's so hard to keep up. That's also something in Japan, I don't know how I will be able to keep up with the Discord. We will spend some time in the, in the bus and the metro and train and everything, but not that much. Okay, technically on this here, this is a um, place for turning all that in fertilizer but also all these flowers are some that i do not have or do not have enough in ombre sometimes i try to have two if one of my ombre is on the field i'm using i want to put another one in my bank so sometimes i already have like the cream i have but I'm mostly trying to, since I'm fertilizing and watering each day, I'm trying to get flowers here that I do not have as ombres. So then it's another experiment. Before I had just any flower, and I think it makes more sense to actually fertilize them daily. If, if I have enough, of course, but here I think I have enough. And then, now I almost have all the flowers that I have on my island as ombres because of this. Because I have many of each flowers that I'm fertilizing every day, so I have more chances of them turning ombre than if I have just the one ombre and hoping that it's... I don't know, propagates or something? I think, for example, my green um, dandelion, the next day I had a, a sprout of, of it, so I turned it into, I planted the second one, and I think the next day turned on bright or something like that, so I was so lucky, I had so so quickly I had this new color and the ombre version of it, but it's not always the case actually. Like these orange and uh, orange and blush. I would say blush. Or no, they're coral. Orange and coratulia. Of course they're not blush. I do not have a white one. I do not have a an ombre yet. 
And what I did here, sometimes when it turns ombre, you do not see it right away. So I actually traveled back to it to check uh, if some did become ombre or not. And actually, I also need to change the time of day again. changed daytime okay so now we can go back to here for some easier experiments. How many fertilizer do I have left? It's always so far away. 50, okay, good, good, good. So here I'm trying um, set up to get the double ombres but apparently it's not working we are not sure yet how to do the double ombres maybe we need two ombres and one normal it's it's not clear yet Okay, so here's another one of the same experiment. Oops. Okay, so what is this one? I would say either red or sky. Red, okay. But this, the way it is, Organized here is very not practical. People have been mentioning double ombres now, so I'm tempted. Okay, let's let's try something here. Try to remember that it was almost last two years. Let's see if I can aim for this to be an empty spot. Hmm. Let's see if I have this one and this one. Hmm. It's not about empty spots. I think it's one thing that actually turns to the other. I think for this one, they actually turn. So it's an original color that becomes another color so I'll try something like that we'll see oh look at that so many oh wait 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 okay so that is very interesting so why did they all bloom here today okay this is interesting because this has a lot of potential of being something else, but it looks still orange. No. Because all of these are ombres. So if I put them next to the orange, that would have been a lot of chances of making other colors. And they did not. Yep. 
Wait, what was this one? Was it just a white fenced one? I guess so. No! What did I do? Well, I mean, the fact that I'm replanting it, it's still the same color, so I don't think it will alter anything. So, this is one experiment that I'm a bit sad that has not yielded anything. Wish me mail three star gift will be. Um, so, this is interesting because it's something that we could not get so far. So is it a resource that is native to only half of the other meadow? Because if they would not not give us a plan if it was something we could do. So I feel that we are missing a resource. But see, like in the top part of the meadow, we had these, um, uh, how's it called? Cat's tail? No. How's it called? Uh, okay, let's go to... Wormtail. The Wormtail, I guess? And those... We... Did not have at the first level of the meadow. So maybe... In the top part, there will be yet another resource that will craft something. But interesting, we need the first, the two stars and the three stars. So that's a lot of gifts. I'm curious. Okay, here's another experiment. Let's see. What? Okay, no, this are just replanted, I guess. Because... Okay, let me check. It should be just a regular... Yes. Hibiscus. And this is normally just a regular something. Okay. Warm pink. Then the lily. Oh, come on! I keep hitting the wrong button. Warm pink, then the lily. And this should be just a red. Well, but then. And so here, this should be just a red, also, well, but then. Where are you? Yes. And here, this is uh, something. Okay. Sky white ombre. So this is a blue Belgian. This is a red Dandelion. Okay, and here we have a hot pink. Like this. But my goal is that here, in the halls, we have interesting things spawning, but we had none today. That's sad. Okay, then, maybe today is time to replant one of these. Because I keep getting more colors of this one, and, hmm, how many is there? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Okay. So, I think that one of the plots in the, the Hops, Hopscotch Highland is 19 plots. Somebody mentioned that. So, there's no point of replanting all this. So if I should move something, I should move the Tullius. And maybe I replant. Yeah, should I move all the Tullius? And leave more space here for them. I wanted to move them because they are 
not sorted and I wanted to sort them because it's ugly and the tulias are kind of sorted but I have less of them now I don't know yeah maybe I should move the tulias Okay, so, okay, if I take it now, I can still water it and fertilize and then I can pick it up. No, okay. <laughs> if I pick it up now, then I have three opportunities of fertilizing it today. Okay. Then I'm not doing anything that I'm saying. Then fertilize, then water, then pick. Fertilize, water, take, fertilize, water, pick up. Okay. Fertilize, water, take, fertilize, water. Okay, I don't know if any had another chance or anything. Okay, technically now I should have the red and the violet plant. Let's see. I meant in uh, in the sprout in ombre. Okay, good, good, good. And this is another tulia. So let's see what we got here. Orange. Okay. Oops. And this could be one that I planted yesterday. You would never know. Is it something interesting? Let's see. It's white. Okay, so not interesting. Okay, so, oh, and we have a miracle here. Okay. So I'll just maybe I'll just do everything because I keep forgetting which ones I have already in okay maybe also I don't have any more fertilizer this is a definite possibility Yes, that's the case. But I got so many new flowers, so that might be the time to go and do another round of transforming into a fertilizer. Yes, that's the case. Okay. So it's been a long time. That's only the second time we do fertilizer, so that's okay. How long have I been streaming for one hour? That's fine. Okay, so we need to be super careful to not try to uh, recycle something that we don't want to, okay? So here I have two of these. Okay. Maybe already the ones that I see on the same page that are several times that helps me. The 
let's see how many fertilizer I can make in one day. People say they do like 200 to 300. Uh, that seems a lot. I'm not sure how many I can produce in one day. Okay, that's... So yellow and yellow, okay. So this one and this one. Then the green, I see another green. So white and red and the red flower. So. Okay. So the white sprout and the white flower already. I mean, it's me who decides to keep one of each just in case. So that's that's my curse. That it's so complicated. Then violet. I have these two. I think it's so good. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay, now I think most of them will be the Tulias. Let's see. Oh no, we have orange and orange. Oops. No. Let's see. I said orange and orange. Then we have the two peach. Well, actually, is that the same? Right. Yes. And the plant in peach. I don't see the peach one. Okay. What about the peaks? It's so hard to keep track of everything. Come on. Okay, let's say not more for this. And then here, a lot of hibiscus. This one maybe we can keep. Mm, I want to keep that. I feel like maybe the sprout is good if we want to replant it somewhere. Okay, so many variables. What do we do with all these now? Especially because we can't really. I guess in the future there will be people who want to have them because they could not uh, play with them. I mean, they did not get them. So they would want some. So they might get more rare. But I'm, I'm not ready to <laughs> compose them yet. But I might have in the future because I'll get so many. I guess also when you get a new color, you're like, Oh my god, I'm keeping it and everything. And then you end up drowning in all of them, like my um, green, green Tulia. I was like, wow, it's so pretty. I should keep it. I keep all of them. And I will have so many of each. And I'm like, no, I'm good. Thank you. I have this one already, yes. 
Oh, so apparently. Okay, maybe green tulia is kind of like. I don't know. See, I'm kind of like. Uh, maybe let's keep it. So here I have all the reds, all the purple, violet, this is violet, and yellow, this is red. So what is these violets and the other violets? So this can go. Then so many sky here. Yeah, we need to find a way to sort them. This is all I mean. Okay, so yellow, so orange, 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 and this one too. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm like, just in case, let's keep all that and then no cases arrive. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> I think maybe I can just do one more, one more set. Okay, so let's see, at the beginning I have purple, purple, but missing one, yes, okay, purple, we are all good, but this, this, and this, because I have all the other, but I'll keep, yeah, I think I did travel one of my blue, yes, this is too dangerous. Yes! No! Okay. I removed the blue. Ah, no, it was. No, sorry, it was not the blue, it was the red. Okay. Okay, it was the red. Okay, sorry. Okay, speaking of reds, I have these here and the one here. Okay. So this one I can move and this one I can move. And here I have only the flower, so I can keep this. And here, okay, so this is green. Green, I have the three here. And remove this one. Oh, yeah, no, we, we said that we could keep this one. I don't know. But I have another one here, that's fine. Mm, orange and yellow. What is the situation? Yellow have everything and orange also. I can remove this one. And I said yellow I have everything. This is what I said. Ah, okay, let's see. Yellow sprout, yes. And I have an orange somewhere? Do I? Oh yes, okay. Okay, let's say that it's good. I won't say that I don't have doubles because I probably will, but I guess I have like 60 fertilizer now, something like that. So we can do another, another good round. 
80. Oh, good. Okay, so I'm at 180. So here we did everything except the big one. And then I guess we still have a lot of work here. Oh, we did not do these here. So here are also just demo ones for fertilizers. So I'm also doing everything and hopefully some of them turn on gray and also we'll have tons of things to compost. Like the, see how many, uh, versions of the, how, Sky Tulia, I have so many Sky Tulia, I think I have a lot more, I had a lot more before, because I managed to get one Sky Tulia, but I used it for an experiment and I did not put it in my, um, list of everything. Oh, also... If we are actually getting rid of a bunch of flowers, so we plant. Oh, this, this one is it a yellow? Oh, I should not have done that because if it is a yellow, I think I keep traveling it daily. <laughs> I keep having like, yeah, is it an ombre? Oh, it's still a yellow daily. I'm doing this. So I've done everything I could here, but here it's too small to do other experiments or anything. Okay, so here we are good. So there's my two ones here. And then we'll have to replant, I think, here. Yeah, let's, let's keep now here. We were going to, when we ran out of fertilizer, I was going to fertilize everything here, I guess. What was the idea? I think I was already fertilizing first. What was that? There's a lot that are already not fertilizable because they are already on brace. Okay. So now you'll have a look at what they are. Should I should I transplant them now? Now that I have more space, maybe. Maybe. No. Also if I pick them up I won't be able to. What am I doing? Okay, you know what? I might as well. hard to know exactly where to put what because it's not like it's really it's not easy to do pairs or anything I cannot do a nice rainbow because of the way the plot is but at least 
I would at least put the two similar together. I guess that would make more sense. Okay, so I think this one is a yellow ombre. So we'll take this one. And we'll find it here. Okay, wait. Everything's yes. Okay, I was so confused. Okay, then here we have the blue. The blue we have it, but not here. But let's say that we'll take the white one here and plant it here. And we keep this one here for the blue. Then this is a cream. And I think we have the cream. Hmm. Pretty sure one of these is the cream ombre. So, also, let's see. Yeah. We'll do this one here. So, this is the ombre. Okay. This is cloud, I think. And also this one we are gonna turn here. Then here let's see if do we have this one here and I do not have the mint one here, but I can put this one. Because it's not perfectly aligned, I don't really care if sometimes I have the, the ombre on top or not, and they're not perfectly, yeah, that's fine. So I keep this one here for the mint that I do not have. And purple I do have, let's see, this one, should I have one? I think I should. Oh, this one turned ombre here. So now it's good. And the purple, I have it, but not the second one, I think. The sky I just planted. And the red. Ombre, I'll plant it here. So it's not perfect, but it's a little bit more organized than it was before. So I know that I still want... Mm, wait, I think it, we did not put the green back. Yes, let's see. And also the... The cream. Okay, let's put the green here, and let's put the cream here. Huh, I thought I had a cream one, but probably also not here. Okay, so I should be good. Oh wait, these are the not water. Okay. Okay, this is good. We'll see tomorrow. I can keep moving them. I don't really care. And here, this one, this one is so pretty. Here I have only this, I think now with the orange, I did have one, but maybe not enough. Also doing an experiment somewhere. But other than that, let's see. Let me water everything so you can see. Uh, wait, water, not fertilize. You can see how pretty this is here. But here, see the difference in between? So this is red, 
no wait so this is white this is white ombre this is red and this is red ombre and this is how is it called blush and this is blush ombre so this is very hard to see the difference when it's down also just honestly here you don't really see the difference at all and it's it's day also and here this is yellow yellow ombre no sorry the, this one is cream this is yellow ombre and this is cream ombre so this is hard and this is my only i don't understand why i don't have that many um hibiscus i have the hot pink and the yellow and yellow, yellow turned um ombre and so i have a green and a green ombre maybe i do need more more ombres ah come on So I should keep. So did you see that these I did not actually fertilize before because I don't really care, but these I cannot fertilize. So then that will be a lot to turn into more fertilizer. Yay. <laughs> What's the use of flowers anyway, except for being made into a fertilizer? So here, technically, I could just leave them blooming and don't really caring. So I guess, yeah, if I'm too busy one day I could just leave these alone and just go look at my experiments maybe because also watering and doing that for every single one is a lot oh it's been a while since I seen a uh, sprout being actually a, a flower like a seed okay so this one, what is it? It's a was it was it a dandelion sprout? A dandelion dandelion sprout. Okay, yellow. Okay. And what about this one? This one could be something exciting because this one is ombre. So it could be another yellow pentstemon. Let's see. Ooh, either white or yellow. Okay, it's a white pencil, man. And what about this one? Should be a uh, orange marigold. Yes. Okay, and these. So, this is the ombre teal. This is a teal. The green I do have, but it's not here. Uh, the blue I do have. And this is the white. And I think the white is here. And I have here the sky. Wait, is it the sky? No, the ice. So, see here in full full light it's so hard to see the different colors but i assure you that these two are different okay so now let's pick them you gotta go and make dinner now but you think uh you need to up your flower game 
Yeah, fertilizer is what will get you more ombres, and if you get more ombres, you'll be able to um, get more colors because you'll put uh, like you can get cross type breeding, cross breeding. So thank you for coming, uh, Helen. I hope to see you soon and have a nice dinner. Okay, so now we can go to here. Oh, now it works again. So interesting. And we'll trowel all these and plant our tulias. So these will all go away. Sorry. I'm not even sure how to also plant the tulias here. This is uh, not the best pattern. Hmm. Told me that some of them did were not fertilized. That's interesting. Okay, so hmm. how do we do this? Can do the purple here. Oh, and of course it's at the very bottom. Yes. So let's do this one and then the ombre here. Violet. Okay, then here we could maybe do the sky. Oh no, that would be. Mm. Let me try again. Mm. Let's see. Yeah, maybe we'll start with the sky. Okay, I have only this guy here. We'll keep this one for this guy. Uh, no, wait. Okay, anyways. <laughs> I keep wanting to do a rainbow, but then I'm like, the rainbow starts with this. No, okay. Then we'll do this one and this one. Then here we can do the hot pink it's hard to see oh yeah so this is hot pink this would be the hot pink uh, ombre then here we can do the this one which is coral coral ombre so then here we'll do red Add red ombre. Then here we can do orange. And we still do not have the orange ombre. And then we'll try and do something like that. Maybe yellow here. And the yellow ombre here, and then here we'll have green. Ah, wait. Yeah, exactly. And green ombre here. Why not have that? And then I have only these three plots left. Okay, interesting. So we'll see tomorrow what it does. Good. So we're good with this. So I guess now. There's only 
now the most exciting part left. How many fertilizer do we have? Twenty three. That might not be enough, but let me show you first what I'm doing. So this is a crisscross pattern. So everything, for example, like this one, I'm always doing a fertilizing and watering. And then this one, I know that it's a new spawn, but I don't want it here, so I'm taking it. Then I don't care about this one. I just want to first reveal the one that are or around a new spawn so I can understand what the color came from so this one here has a chance of being many things because we have this one is an ombre Dandelily, so it could be a yellow dandelily, but I don't know if it's a transferred one or not. So that is not really interesting. It is a yellow dandelily, but it could come from this native one or cross type between these, cross breed between these two types. Not very interesting. Uh, actually, we have this one here. Nice. Okay, so let's see what else. Oops. This just spawned here, and it's no more orange one. We also need a place to put all these marigolds. I'm not sure where we will put all these marigolds. Oh, for some reason, I feel like the one in the middle here is an ombre. It looks ombre. Okay, it has three potential ombres around. Oh, it's not an ombre. Huh. Two, yeah. It's just a normal yellow tulia. Okay. Boring. So it's been weeks since I had anything cool. Not really weeks. No, that's not true. Uh, two days ago, I actually got a... So I very often get new ombres. But... Uh... I got this yellow pentamon here. This one is exciting. Okay, and now here this is a new. But there's no surprise here. I think it's just a purple. I mean violet. This one just looks like a violet. And it's just a violet. Okay. Okay, what else do we have here? I think one of them should be a red. No. I think this one should be a red. Yeah, so that's here. It's probably just a regular red. Yeah. Here it's probably a regular orange. I've seen one person mention that I have. Oh, one person has a two tone 
marigold. That's very exciting. And one person has another color marigold. But I was not paying attention to the Discord. I have not caught up with the Discord yet. So probably many more color come in. Okay, here it could be something interesting. It could be a red. It could be a red hibiscus. Is it a red hibiscus? It is! Yay! Cool! Very exciting! Okay, so this is the only new flower that we got today. I'm wondering if now, for example, here, let's see. Uh, Technically, we could also get a hot pink Tulia, which we have, but we could get a hot pink uh, Baldette normally. So I hope that, yeah, I was wondering, should I keep this setup? But I think it's worth it. I'll just... Mm, just take a screenshot like that. Mm, that's not very clear. Screenshot like this. Oh, sorry for the noise. And then. Sorry about that. Okay, so then I know where everything is from. So now that there's no more spawns, I think. Let me see. Yeah, I don't think so. So now I just take everything. Again, and fertilize if I can. And when I ran out of fertilizer, I go make more. So now we need to plant this hibiscus. We need to also. Maybe two more. Oh, you know what? <laughs> this one big thing that we have not done is the big uh, fertilizer farm. That I hope that this one gets new ombres also. And technically here, by fertilizing the ones that I have not fertilized yet these can still turn ombre you know so okay I guess that my uh... sorry um... yeah for making new ombres I have a very efficient technique, but now I feel that for making new colors, this is just random and maybe it should be a little bit less random and more thought. Like for example, if we need to get all these colors of marigold, okay, this is something that uh, I have prepared over there. To to get the marigold farm, I guess. But um, yeah, what do I need now actually? Just 
Julius. Do I need? Yeah, I had the list of all the flowers that I was needing, the colors, to be able to make all the possible things. So, for example, we still need a lot of things in um, a lot of things in hot pink. So I have only a hot pink tulia, but I need a hot pink velvetum, I need a hot pink penstemum, and I need a hot pink dandelily. So we should try and be more specific with this one. I don't know, so is it worth replanting everything again? Maybe when I'm for 12 hours in the plane to Japan, this is something that I could do. Also, I have so many videos to edit. But 12, 12 hours starts a lot. So I could probably do a lot with my flowers and edit. Okay, okay. So here I'm good. So now let's see what my thing looks like. Do we have any sprouts that are ombre? No, but do we have any seeds here? No, apart from this one here. So this red hibiscus, what do we want to do? I think I want to plant it over there. With the yellow and everything. here because here it is close to two no to one ombre and that could make a green hibiscus potentially so why not That's good. Okay, and now what do we do with all these marigolds? Honestly, what do we do with them? Eventually, we'll put them in the... in the... thing to make fertilizer. But all of these, we can plant them. I need these. We don't know what to do with them because we don't have anything to do. Oh my god, I'm so dark. Let me put the camera a little bit. No. Okay. Hmm. Okay, so for now, I yeah, but all of these I should plant them in strategic places, but I'm not sure yet. What is the strategic place? <laughs> but at least I should not leave them all in my inventory. So leaving them overnight in the inventory is stupid because it could actually. Um, make more make more fertilizer in the future if i have the flower grow so not planting it is too good let's see how many we have left oh 
we have zero left. Oh, yeah. So maybe we did not even fertilize everything over there. So let's really make tons of fertilizer. Okay, here we go again. I don't know with what I might try and make it first. Uh, okay. So first everything that I have double. Wait, that I still need it. And technically I still need another one of the yellow. But now I don't have that much space left to put all these things. I think why are they suffering me? Okay, yellow. Yeah, maybe stacking is a good idea, maybe not, I'm not sure. Okay, wait, you know what? I should start by the beginning because then I'll have less and then I will need to go down less. Anyways, so the violet, okay, then the yellow, yellow flower, and this one, so just gonna go on this. Come on, this can go. Then I think that the sky I have it multiple times. So the sky, yes. Then the red I have to ombre the flower here and another ombre then orange is that the only flower yes then yellow no yellow checked okay coral because I need this I will keep the flower okay so that is good for the tulias. And also it's night. Okay, so if we start from here, maybe. But I'm still so confused. Oh, white, yes, okay, white. Imagine, I'm confused because I have so, not that many, but when we'll have the 1000 or something, that will be insane. So I think the green also, I do not have it in my plot. And also these mint also. This one, I think I do have it in my plot, so I think I'm good. Okay, so purple and then blue. Wait, blue already? Okay, blue. So everything, maybe I'll go like that. Everything that is blue, I remove it because I have it. Okay, maybe that's a good way. Then I go back. Purple, I just need to sprout. Okay. Okay. Okay, 
and green. Um, wait, did we see we wanted to keep it? Yes. But also, I don't have that many places to paint them, so... Okay, light blue. No, there's no light blue. This is... Ice? This might be ice. Okay. Then sky. Okay. Okay. Now yellow. I have this front. Okay. Okay, then cream. Okay, then uh, red sprout. Okay, I think it's a good way. Okay. Then white. Just front and the oh, okay. Okay, then all these greens, oh my god. So this is Lime. Then we have mint. Okay, and I can remove one flower okay. I keep the sprouts okay then we have I'm not sure actually this is pistachio do I have extras I'm not sure and I think that's it for the bell button. So now let's do the dandelions, red. Okay. And I think I have it there, yes. Oh, yes, many reds. Okay, I think it's easier <laughs> to send them even at knowing. Okay. Then we have cream. Just flat, maybe more. Interesting, no sprouts. Yeah, because I don't have that many that spawn actually lately. Okay, good. So green, we have green and the sprout and this. 
Then here, uh, no, white, 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 then I can remove one flower, two flowers, and one on break. Let's do yellow now. Oh my god, I'm sure there's so many. Okay, yellow. Okay. Also, yeah, this one I have. I'll be sure to be careful with the other ones that I do not have in my field, special field. So we said yellow. Okay. So this is blush. Wait, are those? Yeah, actually, okay. Those are blush and blush. And so, yeah, let's see. Yes, yes, and the ombre. Okay, so everything else blush can be removed. Okay. And if I see another cream sprout, okay, so orange, orange, I need a sprout. And also just a flower, right? Yeah. Okay. So this is warm pink. Or is this warm pink? I'm so, I'm confused now. Okay, the dark pink, let's see. The dark pink. Okay. The light pink. So I need these two here. And also these. Okay, and. I oh love no, the light pink, I have more. Okay. It's not light pink, it is. I am not sure of the name now. Blush? No, we said blush before. So confused with everything. Okay. And here do we have also I wanted to pass them maybe? I'm so tired. Okay. So, mm -hmm. I need to do something with the marigold later, and I'm not sure if I want to spend all that time doing the same thing for all these. They all look the same. This is insane. 
this is insane so i if somebody is um colorblind in playing this game this is crazy so i think that the names will help a lot okay but i don't know if i want to do everything again so let's see The light blue and the so white and teal. So teal, I have everything here. And white, everything here. Okay, I think that's it because there were a few more, but I think I have made a lot more fertilizer now. That should be enough. A hundred and twenty nine, and we had a hundred and eighty, so we are at three hundred and nine fertilizer. So now we can go back to here. And uh, how many? Two hours in. Oh, yeah, no, we need to be day. Daytime because if not, you're gonna see anything. Well, actually, I still have some plots around here, but I don't know if they would be useful for any experiment. Okay, so let's see this. Those are the coral, right? Yes. But see how many corals I have and also, yeah. Now how many of each I have, and that's just crazy that I still don't have it in a, in a, in ombre yet. we get a few more ombres today what did we get oh yeah we got a red hibiscus cool this is exciting i've been having only two colors of hibiscus for a while So I've been, I also want to collect everything and have the nice uh, pattern of all my, no, I don't know, arrangement of all the cute flowers to have all the potential uh, colors and everything. But also some of them I have the, I already had the ombre, but I decided that I wanted to keep them for experimenting with something else instead of keeping it just 
for nothing, I guess. And then this is why I trying to get a second one maybe. But also I'm wondering if I should even get back all the ones that are supposedly enough and that I already have so that I could get another like more experiments. Mm -hmm. I feel like this color is different than this color. Maybe not. Okay, this one. And then I'll just use the teleporter to come back and see if any of those did not change colors yet with the fertilizer or not like did i get a gradient that i did not notice i don't think it's the case okay so we'll keep doing this This one in the future, I should also do experiments. I mean, now you've seen that uh, now the Tulias have their own place and the bell buttons have their own place. The Penstemons are still with the Dandelities, but now that we have the Marigold, do we do another space for the experiment of the Marigold? Oh, I think I have a space that is free now because I, one of my experiments, I changed it and I moved it. But I don't have an embrace with me now, so what I, could I try? Your girls are so quiet. I mean, it's boring, I know, to do the flowers. But I'm curious to see how other people do it. Tell, tell me about your flowers. What have you got? Do you like it? Are you stressed out about the flowers? I usually dream about flowers, and when I close my eyes, I see flowers. So this is not a good thing that when I have spent too much time doing that. What did I say I wanted to do after that? I don't remember. Yeah. I have this marigold that we need to, to do something with. Yes. Okay, after that I'm going to Do some marigolds. Maybe I should rethink the whole the whole plot for experiments. Hmm. Okay, I think what we should do now, like I did in the past live stream when I've done that with my flowers, I should look at all the things that I have, the flowers that I have and see if I can re make these experiments a little bit more efficient. Okay, so those are good. Oh found some that I didn't, did not fertilize. Who was that? Somebody did not get fertilized. Okay. 
the other day I think I got three new ombres and today nothing really oh, another one here huh okay I'm a bit sad so 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 Let's see. Here. I don't know, this is a purple. I can, I can look, I guess. Is it same day two? Yeah, this is a violet tool. Okay. So, here. And what is this one? I don't remember. Here, actually, nothing interesting would come. But if I put it, this one, I think it's just a white pentagon. What? Oh, it's not just a white pentagon. Okay, it's a green pentagon. So, sorry. So here I could get a green. Okay, I'm very really tired. A green marigold. But I guess this the important thing is what are the important flowers to get. So for that, I guess I will look at my chart here. Mm. So I have a checklist for everything that is very good for the, so it's in Google Drive, somebody made it, I don't remember now who did it, but I have this checklist and then I have my regular um, checklist that is kind of the same but you have uh, I mean I have put what other people have found but on it I have written all the main colors that every flowers should get and so bell petals we do have the violet we do not have the hot pink and we do have the sky so in Belveton we just need the hot pink so we should definitely yeah I should be more ah, let's see oh these are kept like that actually but I don't think this is mm, working let's see oh yeah I think that my cozy island experiment can be triggered to something else. Okay, so we need a bell button. Oh, well, actually, here I could get a hot pink bell button here and here. And yeah, yeah. So, okay, it's not bad already. Then, Tulias, we have green. We do not have a blue Tulia. Ha, huh, we need to get ready for that. Hot pink Tulia, we do have. And a white Tulia. 
I think one of these is white. I think this one is white. So here and here I could get a white tulia. And blue tulia also. I think I checked last time that everything could come. Now the thing is, let's see. No, yeah, I think I still everything is possible. Let's see here. Okay, I'll, I'll stay here to see if what else Tulia we need to give him. Okay, actually in uh, in hibiscus we need sky sky hibiscus. Is it possible here? And that's it mainly. So I think all of these should still be. I think if I, if I still um, fertilize that, that will help. Okay. So. Yeah, maybe that's the only possible here. And then we got a red one and a yellow one. So we need white, green, sky, and blue. So here we can get white and sky. Okay, and if we go... I don't know actually if I should make one of these and be sure to add everything around, you know. Hmm. Yeah, also I wanted to finish putting all the fertilizer here, which I did not do. I forgot that. So, maybe sometimes I forgot and then I wonder why I do not have new sprouts. I forgot to fertilize everything. Okay, so I think this is a blue. So yes, this should be good for what we said here, for the blue and maybe that's even the green, no. Do I have, last time I checked, there was every possibility. This is a violet. So I should check that before I pick up all the flowers because now it's impossible to see. enough fertilizer for the whole field. So, where is some green velvet things? Oh, maybe that's it. But maybe that's only a, a green ombre, maybe. Well, that is a green, I guess. But it's not very close to... How many do I have? One, two... Hmm. Well, well, well. Green, I'm not sure. And blue, we checked blue is good. And violet, I think, yeah, this one is violet, but violet, uh, ombre, I think this one too? I don't know, so that should be okay, or this is violet, it's 
so this is fine. Yes, now it's just the marigold. This could get purple, so... Uh, this could get hot pink. And these, honestly, I'm not sure because they're so small. So... Should I travel everything and start over? But I'm so tired. <laughs> Maybe that's a goal for the plane in two days. To start over and be more intentional. Maybe. Maybe that's long enough of the live stream. Oh hi! Random hello. Sorry, I was I was in a different tab and I did not see. Some of the colors so hard to teleport. The pastel pens them all look the same. Yeah, actually, yeah, even if it's daytime, I have difficulty seeing. So the only good way is like picking the flower and looking at what you have. But I agree. So what is your strategy, a random hello? I'm not sure if I should travel everything and start over here to be more intentional. Like I should put all the red together, like, I don't know, all the red and, uh, and uh, hot pink in uh, an area and something like that, I don't know. Because here I had red and red and hot pink and it made the red. Oh, but I'm, so, I'm so tired that I'm actually not thinking straight uh, anymore, I think. So maybe... Uh, stop the live stream here. What uh, what time is it? Seven thirty. Yeah, maybe. And I'll think about that later and do it in front of the TV. <laughs> Something more uh, efficient, I guess. Well, thank you so much for joining me for this live stream. This is the last one before I go to Japan, and. Then you want me see me live for about a, a week. No, I see I'm so tired. You won't see me live for another month, but when I come back, I'll pick up the live stream again. But don't worry, when there's new updates, new events, I will still make videos, just not live streams. But I'll find ways of making videos for you guys so you are not lost. And also you see tons of cool things of me doing in Japan in relation with Hello Kitty and uh, and I don't know if there will be any Hello Kitty Island adventure stuff but Sanrio and Hello Kitty Desert Hello Kitty theme park I'm looking forward to that so thank you so much thank you so much for watching bye bye